Welcome to our Seed to Sauce series where we're highlighting uh, different ingredients that we started from seed and are growing here in Lowell, Massachusetts uh, with our partnership with Mill City Grows and UMass Lowell, uh, our Sustainable Institute. And we have our first ingredient that we started harvesting uh, that we're going to feature today. And that is the Sun Gold Tomato. So we use Sun Gold Tomatoes in uh, originally our Brian Burroughs Curry. Uh, that is a sauce that we get uh, turmeric, lemongrass, Sun Gold Tomatoes. Uh, for the peppers, we use Scotch Bonnet, hot Hungarian wax peppers, and a little bit of Carolina Reaper. Um, and then we also use a shit ton of Sun Gold Tomatoes in our Sun Gold sauce, a pasta sauce um, that really takes on the characteristic of this ingredient. So Sun Gold tomatoes are cherry tomatoes. Um, they're definitely smaller than their heirloom, uh, but don't let their size fool you. They are packed with flavor. So when we are growing these, uh, they are very viney. Uh, a lot of folks uh, use these in tomato cages, but also trellising. Um, we ended up kind of just going with the jungle method of just letting it grow and uh, it's kind of crazy in there to, to harvest these. Um, we are learning every year uh, with what we're doing so uh, we'll definitely be making some improvements next year but one thing that is working is that it's just having a tremendous yield. So we just picked 26 pounds of Sun Gold tomatoes um, but I'm gonna you can just take a look at this color it's really kind of a deep orange. They go from a green to a yellow uh, to this orange and almost even like red at the top here. So I'm gonna just kind of pop one and explain the flavor in here. So they're, they're just so juicy and sweet. I think the sweetness and the crispness really stands out with it. Definitely has uh, kind of that signature tomato flavor. I'd say these are a little bit more acidic um, so have that kind of tanginess in there. And that really translates in the, the way we use them with our sauces. Uh, the Sun Gold sauce is very bright, very floral, very fresh flavored. Um, and then with the curry sauce, um, that's a very different style because we'll pick these, um, we'll mash them into our fermented mash and then we'll let them age for up to a year. Um, and that will kind of really taint, take on this tanginess uh, this umami from the fermentation. Um, so it, it's a different taste profile that translates over, but again, it brings that, um, that sweetness, that natural tanginess, and that crispness. So, um, yeah, with these, we're, we're uh, picking these really every two days. Uh, they're very productive. They come in so fast. Um, it's a lot of work to pick these because they're so small and you have to reach around. Um, but it's well worth the effort. So um, if you ever see these orange Sun Gold tomatoes, go grab them. They're really good and salads, um, really great for making a homemade pasta sauce or, or messing around in the kitchen, adding them to some foods. Um, I actually just had them on some crackers with pesto and this, and it was phenomenal. So definitely if you, you see these around, uh, go grab them. And they're also great at your home garden because uh, the tomatoes are very resilient and uh, very productive as well. 